Today's lesson is how to delete slash clear media cache files from your Premiere Pro. Media cache files can take a whole bunch of space on your computer slash laptop. And it's harder for you to download your project to your computer due to space issues. And I'm here to save your life. I'm here to rescue you from that. The first step to do is click on edit. You go down to preferences. You go to media cache. All right, so it pulls up. I don't touch anything from here. The only thing I touch is remove media cache files. I click on delete and don't worry. It's not going to delete your videos, your projects, or anything like that. Media cache file is like a backup. Once you're working on a project, it has a backup files to it. And I know you have old media cache files from last year or a few months. And it's just taking over your space because you're not using it no more. You click on delete unuse media cache files. Okay, so I had to fast forward this video because I had a lot of media cache files I didn't delete in months. Perfect, I deleted, I removed all the media cache files that's not used. So sometimes you can, they can delete automatically, but I usually delete it manually. It says automatic delete cache files older than 90 days. Automatically delete oldest cache file when cache exceed 93 gigabytes. So you can customize it, your preference, but my preference is I'd rather go in and delete it myself. So I press OK and everything is deleted. I got extra space and I'm ready to download and work on more projects. If this video helped you out any kind of way, please like, subscribe. I'm dropping videos almost every single day and stay tuned. You might learn something.